Wolves dealt defensive injury blow during Crystal Palace clash. Bruno Lage's Wolverhampton Wanderers squad has, on Saturday, been dealt a fresh blow on the personnel front during their Premier League meeting with Crystal Palace. The player forced out of proceedings? Kai Jana Hover. Amid something of a stop-start campaign to date, youngster Hover was afforded just a fourth league start up against Palace in a wing-back role on the right of Boss Lage's back five. The Dutchman, however, lasted just 25 minutes before pulling up with a fitness problem. In turn, after being tended to by the host's medical team, Hover was eventually left with little choice but to limp out of proceedings, replaced by Johnny Otto on Wolves' right flank. The latest personnel problem to have struck their ranks actually marks just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to Wolves' woes thus far on Saturday afternoon, though. This comes with a dismal performance having left Lage and Co and a two-goal hole heading into the interval. Opening the afternoon's scoring for Palace was Jean-Philippe Mateta, before Wilfried Zaha made it two from the penalty spot just beyond the half-hour mark. Wolves, as a result, will need to step up in a major way over the course of the second 45 to be in with any shot of avoiding a third successive defeat and seeing their shot at European football dealt what could prove to be a fatal blow.